<laughs> you look so beautiful. You want to get out? Yeah. You want to get out? Huh? <laughs> Let's get you out. I don't think I could do it with one hand. Hi, poopy. Oh, she's pooping. I'm disturbing her morning poop. Good morning, guys, and welcome back to my channel. Can you say hi? Huh? Isabella is five months old. I almost forgot. I almost said six months. She's five months old in a week, and she weighs, can I tell him? 18 pounds. 24 inches she is such a big girl she can sit like assisted if i'm right here with her so a lot has changed i think the last time i uploaded was probably about two months ago but there's really no excuse for it i mean i love creating videos i just kind of got in we moved so i kind of got in this like funk of um, not knowing what to post and you know just kind of making excuses but we're here today to do a five month old baby update her face is a little orange because she ate carrots um, we have been doing baby food purees so I've been making those and I'm going to share a I'm gonna do apples today apples and cinnamon I think and I will share that recipe with you guys and kind of how I make it and what I do but basically I've just been steaming organic veggies or now I'm going to do a fruit apples because this is the first fruit that I've given her so hopefully she'll like it actually I gave her like a little tiny taste of a banana but this will be like the first puree that is a fruit um, we started with green beans and we've done carrots and sweet potato so apples is next and yeah I'll show you guys how I do that so honestly I think I'm only gonna be doing this will be the last puree I'm gonna do and then we're gonna do baby blood weaning um, I'm still gonna like read up on it because I'm not like a pro at it but we're gonna do that so we're gonna finish up what we have in the freezer but making baby food is seriously so easy it takes me 10 minutes each time and you can just batch make it and freeze it and it can last in the freezer for up to three months so it's definitely not as like daunting as it seems um it's not hard at all you can definitely do it um but yeah so i thought i would just update you a little bit on isabella she is so strong now she laughs she loves to laugh and smile and she doesn't really like to roll over. She's done it, but she just she just refuses to do it again. But she's definitely done it before. She just doesn't like to do it. But yeah. Um, also, I'm like thinking of what direction. This is like totally off topic. I am trying to think of like what direction I want my channel to go. If I want it to be like more mom motherhood related because i'm also a personal trainer and i love like fitness and health so i don't know if you guys would be interested in me like incorporating that all in one like workouts fitness health motherhood kind of all in one if you guys want to see like guided workouts or what you would be interested in so definitely leave a comment down below what you would like to see from me or any video ideas can you say hi She's drooling a lot. I think she's getting teeth. Say hi. Say hi. Ooh, do we like the camera? <laughs> <laughs> it's all you, Isabella Show. Say hi, guys. My name is Isabella. And I'm so cute. I love to eat. I eat so much, I eat all my food, 
and drink all my milk. I drink eight ounces. Oh yeah, that's another update. I am not breastfeeding anymore. Um, <sighs> I honestly feel really bad about it, which I shouldn't. I shouldn't let like that, I guess, mom guilt take over. Um, but you know, you hear so much about it, like, oh, breastfeeding is better, blah, blah, blah. Well, sometimes women can't produce enough milk or they can't produce milk and you have to feed your baby. So there is no shame in formula feeding at all. I just wanted to say that. Um, but yeah, we are formula feeding. Um, I had a lot of stress to get back to work and the job that I have, it's just, I'm actually allowed to take her to the job that I go to um, and it just wasn't possible for me to breastfeed like while I'm there um, so that was like added stress on that and um, also I was feeding her I was breastfeeding her and she never was getting enough so then we started incorporating formula then and then my supply went down so which is the added stress of like going back to work and everything and it kind of making it impossible i just decided to do formula feeding we're hoping that with our next baby um, our situation will be a little bit better and i'll be able to stay home longer and be able to breastfeed longer but like i said Fed is best. You don't let anyone make you feel bad. You are an amazing mother. You are the the mother for your baby and the mother that your baby needs. And whether you decide to formula feed or breastfeed, that's amazing. And you're doing a great job. So yeah, say say we'll see you guys later. Mommy's gonna make some baby food. We have to go to the grocery store. I'm kind of debating if I want to go to the grocery store this morning or do that save that for later but i kind of need to go so we'll see how the day takes us but this little girl has already eaten i've had breakfast done a little bit of work and yeah we'll just keep going about our day say bye So Isabella is taking a nap. So I'm gonna make her baby food and I'm gonna show you guys how I make it. Um, so what you're gonna need is apples, uh, cinnamon. You're gonna need a peeler, knife, and then I, you realize you don't need to wash the apples since they're peeling them. And then a steamer basket, a large pot, that the steamer can fit in and I put too much water so there only needs to be about two inches and it doesn't need to come into the steamer basket so I'm gonna dump some of that out you're gonna bring this to a boil and yeah that's all you need so I'm gonna just peel these and chop these up into small cubes I love that belly. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi. 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 H
Say, I've started screaming. Yeah. I've started screaming and doing crazy stuff. <laughs> This is what I do when it's tummy time. She loves to just lay her head down. <laughs> but she can do like a little Superman. Here, let's try putting your hands in front like this and you can see yourself in the mirror. Yeah? What do you think? What do you think? What's wrong? You're my little ladybug. You brighten up my day. With rosy cheeks, you smile at me and chase my blues away. You're my baby bumblebee. You are so very sweet. You fill my days with lots of joy. Like honey, you're a treat. All right, so I finished her baby food. The consistency is a little runny. Um, so don't add as much water as I did, but it'll be fine. I'm just going to put it in a container and put it in the fridge and then give it to her tonight. Um, but these are the storage containers that you can get off of Amazon and I'll link them down below. Um, I really like them. They work really well. Um, the only thing about them is that I didn't know and I filled it all the way up to the top. And then once it froze, um, this thing in the center couldn't press down, which, sorry, it is very hard to hold her. She's so wiggly. Um, then you can't press the center down, so it can cause the baby food to get that, like, frost on it. So just don't fill them up all the way, and you'll be able to press the center down, and it should be fine. If you don't have any, like, storage containers, you can actually use breast milk bags so what you would do is you would portion it off so however much you're going to give your baby um you would put it in one of these and then freeze it and when it comes time to defrost you can stick it in a bowl of hot water and defrost it that way and what i did was cut a little slit on the end of the, like the corner and then i just dumped it into a bowl and it worked absolutely perfect so if you have a lot of these, like I do on hand, you could use that. Um, so yeah, let me know if you try this recipe for your baby and I will show and show you guys how she likes it too. Say hi. She's sitting so good and she can stand. If you just hold her like this, she can stand up. She does like a little tapping. I'm going to show them how you dance, how you tap dance. She knows how to tap dance. That's an update. No. That's a second. Yeah. All right. This is apples and cinnamon, okay? Do you like it? That looked like she liked it. Oh, goodness. Do we like it? What do we think? <laughs> what do you think? She's like, what is that? I say, ah. There. <gasps> <laughs> She's reacting better than the... Sweet potato. Sweet potatoes. Yum. Ooh, we love oh, that. Oh, yeah. She's loving this. Oh, my goodness. Say, we can't get enough, can we? Oh. She's like swallowing, Nelly. Uh, watch. She can try to put it in her mouth by herself. Look. She, <laughs> oh, she went straight at it. There we go. Good job. She just needs to learn how to get it off the spoon. There we go. Good job. She did it. Mm -hmm. Good job. 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 Good
good morning guys um so it is the next day obviously one second mm. okay so let me put this down i kind of wanted to show you guys oh update on the apples i'm so sorry i'm scatterbrained but update on the apples she woke up she ate so many of them she loves apples don't you yeah you see that snotty face oh my goodness hi so we had to say good morning to you this video is all about you yeah she loves this chair see i'm just getting off topic of everything but she loves this little chair we got it off of amazon for like fifty dollars I don't know I really like the colors I feel like it's a little bit different I mean it's a baby thing but we love it right yeah do we love it but anyways so she ate so many apples she wanted more but I basically gave her probably like a whole jar and she ate all of them but she woke up at 4 a.m. and she never wakes up at 4 a.m. And she drank an 8 ounce bottle at 4 a.m. And so I'm just a little bit tired right now. But that's okay. Um, it is 9.30. So we're going to make it, right? We're going to make it? Okay. But I kind of wanted to show you guys before my camera dies. The things that we use to feed her. So like her high chair. So this is the high chair we have. I get a lot of questions on my Instagram. Um, oh, if you're not following me over there, definitely follow me. Um, so we use the Aura Bell. We got it off of Amazon. Someone got it for us. Um, so, so thankful. We love it. It's amazing. This little thing adjusts and it can literally just lay back like that. Or it can sit up completely like that and then it also comes with the tray which is in the back and so yeah that's what we use and then I literally only have one bowl and spoon and this is the Simca Rose we got it off of Amazon and this like this like can stick to the counter so it won't come off and it comes with this cute little spoon and then we use these bibs Again from Amazon, I'll link everything down below. These are the bossy, sassy, like little bandana bibs. And then I also wanted to show you guys these other bibs we use, which we'll probably use a lot more when she gets a little bit bigger. We got these off of Amazon. Um, they're super cute. Last thing is these containers. I'm not sure if I showed you. I am gonna put actually her apples in here right now before my camera dies. Um, so it kind of just goes like this and I recommend not filling it all the way up. That way you can put this middle part into the center and really press down because if you don't press down all the way, it'll get frost on the baby food, which I mean, it's okay, but I'd rather not ha have it like that. Um, so just be sure to press down if you do get these and you basically just spoon them into each little container and I do about two big spoons because that's about how much she eats each time. If she wants more, I'll give her more. This is how it looks and then you just put the lid on and you... Put it in the freezer and it's good for up to three months all right i think we're going to end the video here i hope you guys enjoyed isabella's five month update she's growing so fast getting so big it's almost her half birthday we're gonna do like a little celebration i got her a cute outfit and we might do some cake but she can't eat it it's for me <laughs> um 
But yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss any videos from us. And let me know in the comment section down below what videos you would like to see from me next. Any suggestions, questions, concerns, anything at all. Um, I'd love to talk to you. And I hope you guys have a great day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. Say bye. She's getting super mad.